Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel T-Spot. In this video, we were aware going into Ted Lasso's season 3 episode, 9 that certain issues needed to be resolved, particularly as they related to Roy Kent. After all, consider Brett Goldstein's character's recent story, or more accurately, lack of a story for a moment. He has been moping around for the majority of the year, and his only major concerns are his job and the interaction he has with Jamie Tart. In the end, we believe Roy still has a lot to learn about himself, some of which weirdly manifests in the form of self-confidence. All things considered, that is a really simple concept to consider. This man's life was largely defined by his status as a football star, but he no longer has that. He lacks a lot of everything. Is Nate's time in West Ham coming to an end as we get ready to watch Ted Lasso Season 3 Episode 10 on Apple TV Plus next week? We don't believe that it is an especially wild idea to consider right now though. After all, we do believe that Nate began to understand who his employer is genuinely at the end of episode 9, and he will find it difficult to reconcile that. He cares about Jade and enjoys the direction things are headed, so he doesn't want to be a shady human or cheat around. Unfortunately, this has a major flaw, and it is as follows. Rupert doesn't exactly strike us as the type of person who can handle conflict well. It undoubtedly ignited a fuse in his head when Nate rejected him at the pub. Will he throw Nate out if he can't manipulate or control him any longer? It might not be not happen right now because Rupert is still the team's owner, and you obviously want them to succeed. Whether Nate likes you personally or inspires to have traits similar to yours is irrelevant. Let us know what you think in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon.